Funding for this program is made possible by Stakert, the yogurt you can eat in your house. June 2017, BM. For months, hundreds upon hundreds of soldiers from every nation in the world have been dropping on the island of Aradel in the middle of an undisclosed ocean. Like all wars before it, it was fought to secure a valuable resource. This time, it wasn't gold, nor oil, but chicken. Many lives were lost in the War of Nutrition, and the details are hazy at best. Yet through hard work, ruthless investigation, and a bit of luck, we've managed to secure archaic footage and communications that tell us the story of that distant era. This is that story. War is hell, but hell isn't real, so neither is war, which makes the trauma experienced by its young soldiers even more tragic. Take Edustus, a young frozen yogurt merchant. He was drafted and whisked off to the island without even going through basic training. Wait, can they hear me? You, is, the, is there a push to talk button? Shit, what are the controls? On an ancient storage unit called a hard drive, next to a folder of mediocre erotic self-portraits, we found videos of Deustus recorded during the war. He's so horny. You got butts? Wow, I'm gonna, so I'm gonna want to mute all of this. However, Adustus wasn't alone. He was partnered with Sage, no waifu, no laifu, water dragon. Probably shouldn't be driving directly into this. No, you're fine, don't worry about it. Don't. Don't worry about it. What could possibly go wrong? Before the war, Sage was a renowned weeaboo, which was ancient Japanese for bringer of God's light. They ran charities, consulted with the Pope, and shared political opinions you didn't ask for. I should listen to some good anti-communism songs again. With Arendelle's bloody quagmire sucking in the world around it, not even our most righteous ancestors were safe. Jesus Christ! <laughs> also, Miles was there. Yo, what's up? However, the squad wasn't yet complete. They needed a wild card. Someone foreign. Someone like Ripple Ree. You wanna hit these? Yeah, we can hit those. Yeah. Okay. Alright, cool. Let's do it. One. Oh god, I didn't hear the two or the three. Go! Finally. A full squad of four young men. The maximum military force allowed by any one country as established by the Genova Convention. However, things were about to take a turn for the worse. And as the great poets of the era would say, when it rains, it gets wet. I have no shotgun shells and 13 scar shots. What the fuck? Oh. What did that? <laughs> what did that? I don't, know. So I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's <laughs> happening right now, but uh, I am holding the gun to my own head. We don't know why Sage incurred such supernatural wrath. All we know is that the universe was not done with him yet. Guys, Will? Jeep. Will, you gotta get out. Guys! Another Jeep? Yeah. Yeah, th what could possibly go wrong? Just keep holding the gun. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sage, you shouldn't drive. Guys, I'm about to die. It was nice knowing you all. Don't no, no, we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. The blue's right here. You're gonna make it. Okay. You're gonna make it. Don't you dare fucking die on me. Okay, we crossed it. We're we here. It. Oh shit. Hey. Dude, we're at the crates. Oh god, we're under fire. Oh, so we're getting shot. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> With Mr. Water Dragon nursing his wounds, the squad was sent another recruit. A man known only as... Are you Sweat Daddy? Yes, I am All right, Sweat Daddy. You're, you're invited. They were fresh, 
undisciplined, and inherently problematic. But what this ragtag squad lacked in experience and ability, they would make up for in inexperience and disability. Down. He's dead. That was the last in his squad. Okay, we have 12 guys alive, and we are four of those. Okay, but um, you people, possibly, I think you have a guy in that shed. Where? From where? Is that you shooting? Yeah. Boys? One down. From where? Give where? Where? Direction. Direction. Two down. Yeah, from the I'm building. Down. Shit! Shit! I'm getting shot too. Okay, he's right there. To where? Where? I see him. I see him. He's down. Nice, nice. Steven, I got you. Yeah, I'm dead. Yeah. Shit, I'm down. You got a shotgun yeah. out. You might, have, you might have one guy to the north huh. in the other shed, so just... Nope, cool. We're in here. We're clear. I'm going to try to bandage up. Yeah, that, that's the guy from north north side. Get him. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. He's not even alone. Yeah, he's behind the tree. Is he dead? No, but I hit him a couple more times. He's going to die really fast. Ooh, I think that I think that shot was coming from the west. Hard to see because you don't have a slant on the There he is. Down. Four left. Two more guys, you guys. Two. Both of the guys. Find the rock. Okay, got one. Hell yeah. Uh, I know I know what the other one is. I know what the other one is. Other one is over here. Get in the circle. He's gonna have to move. Guys! Come on guys. Yeah, he's in the grass, he's in the grass. I see him, I see him. We did it! We did it! Nice. We, we won! Holy shit! Oh, it's my first win! I got zero Oh kills. my god! And zero hits, but Steven. I technically won. Steven, oh my god, you're my daddy. They would get to eat tonight. However, the sweetest victories are often the shortest lived. Join us next time as we continue to follow our boys through the greatest and only war we have a record of. Next time on Letters from Zarki.